I was speaking with a bank manager the other day and I was asking him, why is it that your softwares are failing? The banking apps, they are failing. They are not, um, the payments are not going through. He said that they have lost most of their senior software engineers. These guys resign and leave the company and then go abroad, relocate to Canada. And they are finding it hard to find talent in Nigeria, senior developers. And I asked him, so how much do you pay senior developers? He said 800,000 naira per month. <laughs> Oh God, not even person. You are running a whole bank, and you want senior software engineers, and you are offering eight hundred k because you think they don't have option. Software engineer that beans to you. Hey, it is an affirming work. Software engineer, if you want senior software engineers, and you don't have up to ten thousand dollars per month, you're not serious. You're not ready yet. Go and think about your life. Anybody can go online on YouTube and learn JavaScript or take a, a, a training program. You learn JavaScript free, free, free or free code camp. You learn uh, PHP, Lotta, free. But to be a senior software engineer it requires years of experience. We're talking about five years, 10 years, 15 years of experience. You, you want to hire this guy with 15 years experience and you're paying him 800K. What is 800K? He reached to subscribe data for one month. Talking about a man. Some of us are married with five, 10 wives. <laughs> See? We are not all in Canada. Senior software engineers, they, we they, with this, all those uh, job applications, job uh, openings you people are putting out, we they see them. We are seeing the job openings, we are not applying because we know that you people are not ready, you are not ready yet to pay. You understand? People are in this country working with uh, 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 countries abroad. See, Nigeria has some of the best software developers in the world. Go and check it. Go and ask anybody that has traveled and been in tech companies and all these big tech companies you are hearing go there to their tech team you'll see nigerians there most of these nigerians are not even in in that country they are in nigeria here working remotely <laughs> it shock you we day all those uh, job openings you are looking for talent that has five years and we the cm you people are not ready yet if you really want to hire talent bring out money Add it to that job opening. If you are listing job opening, you are not putting the amount you are going to pay there. <laughs> Who do you think you are, you are about to trick? Somebody that is comfortably earning, let's say, $5,000 per month. You need his talent and you are putting a job opening without uh, without putting the, the amount you are willing to pay. He will not apply. You know, Ingo, they forward them. He will download it and forward, they send the link to a junior software developer that is jobless. Now, those people could apply. If you need talent, you have to, first of all, put the amount and that amount should not be less than it should be between five to ten to fifteen thousand dollars per month i'm not talking about per year per month we are talking about somewhere around four to to eight million naira per month that's where you see talent software development are beans for to you you understand if you have if you have tried to learn software development before you understand what i'm saying it's hard as hell not many people make it <clears throat> it's like the seal team is equivalent to joining the u.s seal team Made thousand starts, but only few make it. Now, out of those few that make it, a lot of companies are looking for senior talent and they're willing to pay. You in Nigeria, see, banks are declaring billions of dollars of Naira profits per, per year. Out of those billions, you cannot bring out five, five, ten, ten million Naira to pay your developers per month. You, you think development meant that beans? They will leave you, go Canada, apply, use your internet, apply for work, go Canada, relocate to Canada. And from there, they send you resignation letter. Now, one Friday like this, everybody go close work. You don't go see them again. Monday, resignation letter through email. When you are serious to pay, bring out some of your profits. Produce some of your profits and make payment. Some startups do that. They raise $10 million, $14 million on the news. All the startup founders are wearing t-shirts, branded t-shirts. Oh, yeah, now pay your developers. You are carrying 500K. What is 500K? <laughs> Can 500K buy iPhone? iPhone 14 Pro Max. I be mean, your developer no deserve that one. You understand? What can he do? Can he pay school fees in Lekki? Your your one million naira per month. You are, can he pay school fees in Lekki? By the time they be you school fees of your first son, you gonna say you cannot work in a company that's paying you one million with with your ten years experience as a programmer. Hiring software engineers is like hiring people that will build your 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 fighter jet. Imagine a country that wants to build fighter jets. If you want to hire software engineers, that's what it looks like. If you, can you pay people that are designing the core systems of your fighter jet or atomic nuclear weapons uh, uh, 500,000 naira per month? If I ask anything, no blow, no blow for your office. Oh God, this country.
See, if you're watching this and you're running a tech team, if you don't want to run a tech team, don't run. You're going to start selling Akara or Biscuit. We understand. But if you're going to build a software and it's the core of your platform, you have to budget the amount you want to pay your senior software engineers. Even your junior ones. Because if those junior ones are working with you and they're not earning enough, once their talent is up to mid-level going to senior, they will resign. The last salary you pay for them, you pay them, they use it to add to the amount they want to use to relocate to Canada. Talk you. <laughs> One day like this, you go just wake up within within one month. All your all your technical staff has, have gone because you're not appreciating their talent. The money you raise from funding, what are you doing with it? You understand? What are you doing with it? You're hiring software developer. You you are not ready to pay. <laughs> it go shock you. <laughs> You'll be getting untalented people. The serious talent they this country. Many don't want to leave. Many are still here because what is more comfortable. But you're not willing to pay. That's why you're not seeing them. You are putting anonymous uh, job openings without. Um, salary.